Oh my god, it's so dramatic. Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm Hannah, I'm your voice teacher. How the heck are ya? I'm doing great. Thanks for asking. Please don't mind my sick voice. I am a little bit under the weather today, but not too sick for us to react to Teen Beach Movie 2. I had such a great time reacting to Teen Beach Movie, the first one. I didn't expect for it to be just like genuinely good. Like the songs, the costumes, the choreography. I, I had a grand old time. If you want to watch that video, click somewhere over here where you can or go search for it and don't make me, why do I have to do all the work? Before we get into the video, please enjoy Hannah on a different day modeling a couple pairs of adorable glasses from Warby Parker. Do you like the new glasses? Do you? Do you like them? Do you like them? <laughs> Just kidding. Warby Parker sent me glasses. Let's try them on. Ooh, I have a glasses problem. I have a million pairs and it's never enough. These are definitely like hot secretary vibes and I kind of like that. I don't know how to light videos without getting that in the glasses. So we're gonna put them up here. Warby Parker, just glasses, right? No, not just glasses. Warby Parker offers eyeglasses, sunglasses, contact lenses, even eye exams. Glasses start at only $95, including prescription lenses. I don't usually wear glasses like this. <gasps> I like how they're almost clear. I feel like when I try on glasses, I always think that it's like the nerd that takes off her glasses and she's hot, but actually she's hot the whole time. I don't know what the vibes are. I just look hot. The end. But the coolest part about Warby Parker is their at-home try-on kit. Order five pairs of glasses to try on at home for free. No obligation to buy. They ship free and they include a prepaid shipping label. How convenient is that? Okay, these are similar. God, I just... I think I look really cute, okay? <laughs> hot secretary vibes was earlier. This is hot librarian. She's feeling herself. Ooh, these ones are green. I like the way that it contrasts with my hair and the fact that I wear pink all the time. So it also contrasts with that. And I love the at-home try-on kit. I love that it ships free right to my door. I can try them on. And if I don't like any of them, there's no obligation to buy. That is magical. I love that. No commitment. I'm not afraid of commitment. <laughs> Are you? My therapist would say otherwise. <laughs> Lol, just kidding. Ooh, what do you think, guys? Okay, we did hot secretary, hot librarian, hot math teacher, I don't know, hot academia. That's the theme. If you're ready to embrace some hot academia in your life with cute, high quality glasses, sunglasses, contact lenses, everything you need for happier eyes, try five pairs of glasses at home for free using this link. Okay, let's do this. Okay. Is he proposing? It? Which happens to be the exact spot we met three months ago to this day. Three months? <laughs> They've only known each other for three months? When is this movie in relation to the first movie? Whoa. Pretty, it's Aww. beautiful. I had to do something cool for a meetiversary. Meetiversary? It all that sounds like a like an event where you celebrate meat <laughs> and your love of meat. You did all this for me? I'd swim to China for you. I'd swim to China for you. That is so specific. And I mean, I guess romantic. I I guess. <laughs> <laughs> The costumes look great. Everybody looks like they're having a lot of fun. I'm not a big fan of this song. I talked about at the beginning of the first Teen Beach movie that I thought the choreography was really cool. This, I like the fact that they're using these beach chairs, but they are, <laughs> they just sink so low. They look like they're leaning forward and having a hard time getting out of the chairs. Like, you know, we've all been there. You sit in that chair and then you gotta like get leverage to get out of those chairs. I don't know. I'm gonna continue watching and have a positive outlook on this video. <laughs> Oh, so they're all mingling now. Oh my God, this poor actress. <laughs> they actually threw sand on her face. Like that was real. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're- I know what's on her face. They probably put on there before, you know, makeup or whatever, but that was legitimate. They put sand on her face. Look how miserable she looks. That is not great. Cool to 
Okay, there was the tiniest little riff on that part that I thought was really cool. Did you hear that? Tell scary stories. We Brady, tomorrow's the first day of school. I've got tons to do. He said, summer's not over yet. She says, tomorrow's the first day of school. In the last movie, her aunt shows up and says, it's time to go to the preparatory academy or whatever she says. So is this, I mean, are we talking like no time has passed? Because it really seems like two weeks max has passed between the first movie and this movie. I guess I'm just surprised. You think things will be different for us at school? We've only known each other in the summer. It's us. We'll be fine. <laughs> yeah, totally. No, 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 no. no. What's wrong? My necklace, the one that Layla gave me, the only thing I have from West Side Story, it's gone. Maybe it's still nearby. Should I die for no. it? No. No, pretty. There's nothing we can do now. <gasps> Is it like water activated? First day of school! Yeah. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Do not miss high school, boys. <laughs> Three-pointer! <laughs> oh, oh. Do you guys remember that, that kid in school? Like, literally, that kid. And you were like, you have undiagnosed ADHD. You know? Because I swear to God, I knew a kid just like him. All right, let me make a prediction. I predict that, I mean, the big conflict of the entire movie is... Oh, my God. <laughs> What's his name? Mac Rust. No, 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 no. His name is not Rusty. That's what I called him last time. Brady, ha. Mac and Brady, they're just too different. Brady is too laid back. Mac is uptight and doesn't want to have fun. And then Brady doesn't feel good about that. So that's the conflict. I, okay, prediction. This is probably so not accurate. The glowing necklace in the water magically brings all of Wet Side Story to them in the future. And then they aren't going back to the 60s. They, they are coming to them. Is that what happens? I don't know. It would be cool if it did. Hey, uh, have you checked out the new oceanography program at Oregon Coastal College? You could spend half a year on a ship at sea. That sounds like my worst nightmare. Universal online college application. College application. I have to say that I think that the first movie definitely moved faster. I liked that right from the beginning, we had conflict, we had somewhere to go. I'm 15 minutes in and I am just uh, snoozing. What? <laughs> Why don't I come with you? <gasps> oh no, you've given them autonomy. Matt. <laughs> That still of his face right here. <laughs> it's just so dramatic. Like, <gasps> Mac, you're standing next to another boy and talking to a c college recruiter? Well, you won't even tell me why you stood me up. Brady, we used to tell each other everything. What is happening with us? You tell me. It's almost like the school you wants nothing to do with me. Three months down the toilet after one day of school. He is the one that the night before was like, <sighs> Do you think that things are going to be different for us at school? And she's like, no, I, I mean, now that you mention it, I, <laughs> I mean, you do apparently because you brought it up. What? This is very dramatic. Mac, you deserve better. I don't know what the other guy's name is, but he showed up for you and he, he nerded out about science with you and oceanography. So he just seems supportive. Also, he's like super cute. So am I going to be alone? And if it's only me, myself, and I, He's got a really I great fun? voice. I'm laughing because it's dramatic. So he decided to fully produce a song. Oh my God. No why? Sorry, I was about to compliment him and then he said why and then that bothered me. No why? No why? I just have a thing about vowels. Anyway, that does not negate how amazing that was. This is the area in his voice that he's singing. This means that he's mixing his chest voice and his head voice together to get this really beautiful blend in this upper middle part of his range. And it sounds really nice. He is kind of reaching his chin up a little bit, but nothing too severe. So I think it sounds really great. And it's got that edge in it that this style requires. Oh 
my gosh. Do you think that they live in a universe where they have like 36 hour days? Because how this all has happened in one day baffles me. It's not adding up. Put me down. Oh. She's conscious. Oh my God. This I did not see coming. She wants to change the movie. Goodbye people always standing around in the background who never speak whose names I don't know. <laughs> Oh my God, was I right? Take a look around at this amazing place. I don't know if it's Earth or if it's You shouldn't space. take things Wherever out of people's hands. Are. Okay, all right, hold on, hold on. I have a complaint about the plot. The first movie was funny because they were transformed into a musical. And so they just were forced to like sing and stuff. And that was funny. And that's not happening here. They're not in musical world, but now they're breaking into song. I don't know. It's not adding up. Why am I upset that they're singing? I'm not. I think he's got a great voice. I can't think of anywhere better right where I wanna be. This is a cute song. This is very cute. Layla's heels are so tall. Dancing around in those heels looks difficult. Like she looks a little bit fearful to do this dance move right here. If you're gonna come to school with me, I should probably make you look a little less like you. Makeover montage, yes. Oh my God, Mac is a huge closet. Is this out of sight on me or what? Mac, why was that in your I closet? Like this song. Oh, it it's like 60s fi 65ed. Yeah. You ready for school? It's true. Great. I thought that was pretty cute. I'm not the kind to fall for a guy who flashes a smile. It goes on for miles. Don't usually swoon, but I'm over the moon. He was just too good for school. And now I'm following for you. I like her voice a lot. Yes, Jordan, sing. <laughs> My voice is not doing great today, but that's the note. She sings that falling for ya. That's in her first passage. So she is mixing. Now Jordan Fisher comes along and then sings that exact note and mixes it so beautifully. Oh my God. Listen to this. I just can't stop myself from falling for ya. Falling for ya. It's so good. It's a breeze. <laughs> what? And especially no singing. One verse. No. One word? No, not even if it's from the heart and moves the story along. If it moves the story along, yes. Listen, you got my head going round like a circle spinning. You made me mad, then you Everybody's staring at him. This girl that starts following him, her outfit on point. Everyone else is wearing a typical Disney high schooler outfit where it's like lots of layers and lots of like long necklaces. And somehow that like never changed. I still think that that's the style. Like we got long shirts, long jeans, long necklaces. And then here comes this baddie behind him and is like serving looks. Great, well, I'll catch you guys later. Well, then I hope you have a really big glove. <laughs> oh, so you can catch us. I'm about to say it. That's what she said. <laughs> Hi, it's the next day. I got really tired yesterday because I was feeling sick. So let's finish this movie. Why is everyone sitting apart? Well, come on, everyone. Where's your smile? It's so easy. Anyone can do it. It's attached to you here on oh your my face. God. <laughs> there are 43 muscles to use. Twist that frown upside down. You gotta twist that frown up, 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 upside down. Why can't I just enjoy things without talking about the plot? I, I'm just so confused by the rules of this universe. 
Okay. (laughs) They're breaking out into song and now everybody's being nice to them. I don't really understand it. Although I like this song a lot. I think this is fun. Now she's singing. Ooh, Brady sounds great. Oh my God. Look at the, the people on the on the being the smile. They're like <laughs> they're like legs are on top of each other, like like human centipede version. <laughs> like the smile looks cool, but you really look closely. <laughs> Why are they on top of each other like that? Ooh. Oh man, I need a minute. That is hilarious. The choreography is really cute in this song. (laughs) We have calculus homework. It's so exciting. Oh, okay. Uh, Have fun without me. Uh, This world sucks. All the girls are so serious. Still looking good. Oh my god. <laughs> this is actually taking a lot out of me. Still looking good. <laughs> what was that? You just made up characters from a movie. You are not real. Huh? Yeah, I would have had a different approach. Honestly, life is better in a movie. Yes! You gotta be. All right, I like this one a lot. The way they stage this is so cool. It's like in my videos. Like every time I say fuck, gotta censor that. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. I love this song. No. Wait, hold on, hold on, Layla, hold on, hold on. I thought that was so cool with the sets and everything. They probably did not film that all in one take, but I'd like to imagine that they did because that was really cool. I don't want somebody to write my lines for me. I want to stay here forever. Oh, um, baby girl. I don't know if you well, that was care. dramatic and potentially terrible. <laughs> the way that they are running. Without the stars. There's no movie. It's vanishing from existence. You guys have to go back. I'm gonna miss you, Mac. We will always be friends, even if we're in different worlds. I just wish I didn't have to leave. That's so sad. Don't be weird about it, just hug. (laughs) That's a little dramatic. (laughs) Is that the end of the movie? I, uh, I should get to the dance. Talk to each other. <sighs> Tell her how you feel, you doofus. Oh, the middle school dance pose. Just look how far apart they are. <laughs> when I grew up Mormon and I would go to like the dances for the, the teenagers, they would say, make room for the spirit. <laughs> Tweet. They are making ample room for the spirit of Christ. Wow. What? We're here for you, Brady. What? You and Mac. It was Tanner's idea. It's not right that things aren't right with you two, so we came to help make things right. 
they're back. And they're back for a very specific reason, apparently. Why didn't we see them have this realization? Why didn't we see any of their reasoning? We just skipped this? What is happening? We risked everything. Some things are worth the risk. You're exactly right. That's all I needed. I can do this. I just needed a pep talk, because he's a doofus. <laughs> okay, I like this. Oh my gosh, are they gonna do a girls versus boys thing? <laughs> okay, I like this. I am really loving this. And I just have to say, yet again, Ross Lynch's voice is so great. He has got, God, I mean, technically he's got like a lot of skill. He's able to go through his entire range in a really smooth and balanced way and healthy, but also he just has such a great sound, like, like pop star material. Oh my gosh. This has become a dance battle. This is why they came back. They had to have one more musical number. Where is the applause? Oh, uh-oh. How do we make this all right? How do we get back before we all vanish? I don't know. When you guys first came to our world, you didn't have the necklace because I hadn't given it to you yet. You gotta talk to Gramps. Where did he get this board? You don't think he knows something? Grandpa knows something. Oh my. Good luck, guys. <laughs> I probably shouldn't be laughing about that. Brady, what is this place? It's my workshop. This was your secret. For some reason. And why couldn't you tell me that? I just thought that you wouldn't respect it. I know that we spent all summer surfing, and it's one of the things we have in common that we both love surfing. But I didn't think that you would respect the fact that I make surfboards. <laughs> This conflict is contrived. I'm sorry you felt like you had to hide this from me. You know what really matters about our future? What? No secrets. You know how I feel like I would approach this if I were Mac? I would be like, this is so cool. Like, you are very talented. Also, you are an absolute doofus for keeping this a secret. Let's not <laughs> do that anymore. What a lame secret. <laughs> like, why? Why keep that a secret? I don't know, this whole thing. And now she's like apologizing? I don't get it. I want another song. <laughs> Let's go. Time is literally of the essence. Every single one of their friends and family just died. I'm so lucky that I found you. Most definitely. They sound so oh, good together. Yeah. Cause when it's meant to be, you go oh. kind of crazy. This is cute. Meant to be, you forget your own name. Kiss. Our eyes meet. Oh. <laughs> I'm invested in the Disney Channel kiss. I'll never forget you. Again. <laughs> Here. Aww. A friendship bracelet. I have a friendship anklet with my best friend Shay. I won't show it to you because I'm not gonna show my feet on the internet, okay? I know better than that. But I do have a friendship anklet with, with my bestie and it's very cute and I never take it off. Make sure you bend your knees when you ride this thing or else you're gonna fall right off. Tana, you hold the T-bar. Layla, you hold on to Tana's waist. Super, super tight or else you're gonna fall. Okay. Okay, you guys good? Does it have a steering wheel? <laughs> Doesn't seem like a surfboard if it has a steering wheel. He didn't know her? There is literally 10 minutes left of this movie, and this is a twist. I do not know what's gonna happen. It's a 1962 beach movie party. Cool. What movie are you gonna play? Layla, Queen of the Beach. Nice. <laughs> I'm not sure that movie's exactly my jam. Take a ticket, and if you don't totally dig it, I'll buy you a mango smoothie. I do love mangoes. Then you're gonna win either way. Ooh. So they've just flipped the script of the way they originally met. Are they gonna do another musical number? Please. 
Wow, they really love this movie. I love that. I don't know how that worked, but her jacket is very cute with the bedazzled name on the back. Really? <laughs> Come on. Sometimes you just got to spontaneously break into song. I wish that's how the world worked. That's how my life works. I am such a loser because when I watch these things, all I can think about is the sand getting in their shoes and how much that would bother me. Like they're going all out and they are definitely getting sand in their shoes and socks. <laughs> I don't know what they're saying, but it is very cute. And I like Mac's outfit a lot. That was so cute. I'm, I'm Brady. Oh, that's really cute. Okay. I have to say, I am a little bit confused by the end. I know you guys are probably tired of me saying this, but I, it really is one of my biggest pet peeves, I think, is I need to know what the reality of the universe is. Like the, the reason that we like musicals is that when they start singing, they're not actually singing, right? We're suspending our disbelief that the thing that they have to say, there's so much emotion behind it that they couldn't possibly say it with words they have to sing it. And Disney Channel movies don't care about that, apparently. <laughs> they don't care. High School Musical was about a musical. And so some of the songs were in the musical and some weren't. And here we are. And I wish that I could stop talking about it, but my dumb brain won't stop talking about it. Okay. That bugs me. However, the songs were really great. The first half, what I filmed yesterday, I got to be honest, I was not having a great time. I was like, man, this is really slow and not as exciting as the first one. And I didn't think the songs were as good, but they really pulled it together in the second half. I think this movie was about... 30 minutes too long, absolutely 30 minutes too long. And the storyline kind of like meandered, but the songs were great. And I really do like the costumes. I liked that Mac and Rusty, Mac and... What's his name? Brady. I like that Mac and Brady got back together at the end. I gotta be real. I, I think they were pretty cute. I think I would have liked at the very end for them to have ended on the Layla Queen of the Beach. Like, I don't think we needed another musical number, um, but that was one of my favorites. I have to say, I think my favorite one was the one at the dance, like the dance battle one. I really enjoyed that. You guys could probably tell because I was like giggling like a little girl. But I also really, really liked the Turn the Frown Upside Down song. <laughs> That one was just really catchy. Okay, well, that ends my Teen Beach saga. Thanks again to Warby Parker for sponsoring this video. Until next time, I'm Hannah. I'm your voice teacher, and now you're all my students. Thanks for sticking around. If you want to, you can check out my Patreon, patreon.com slash Hannah Bales, and my social media, TikTok and Instagram, at Hannah.Bales. Okay, I'll see you later. Bye.